The point is excellence comes in a lot of different forms and our job is to find it, identify it, and market and quit comparing. That's it. As a sport though, we're struggling there because, and, and you remember this, you know, it wasn't that long ago when we were very active in the officiating side that plus one, you know, we struggled to use plus one. It took time. It took skill. It took a little bit of effort. We're at the same spot. I tell you, we've been here for three or four years on using plus one and a half and we're not using it enough and we're not using it accurately. So that's I, my take on that one. I know. No. And I, I, I couldn't agree more. I was just, I, you know, I was thinking about that. You know, if, if when we were involved in this thing, if we would have told you that, you know, if you'd have told us that our officials were using uh plus one at 35% of the time, we'd have gone, thank God. Goodness, I mean, we wouldn't have believed it, right? I mean, I, so I, there is there is improvement for sure, but I yeah, Snowblind would have had John would have had, he'd have had a field day if they would have said with used at thirty five percent of the time, right? But and I and this doesn't mean that oh gee whiz that's good and we're just going to give it a plus one and a half because we're not using it enough. That's not where we're at. I think that the industry. If the riders themselves, the judges who are, you know, professionals themselves, I mean, your committees, whatever, they have to define that and they have to teach it. And that's what's not being done. Yes. And I agree with you. Not only teach it, but then they got to manage it, which is implement sure. it. And you're right. And are we seeing it all the time? And that single digit and below single digit is what we're seeing as an industry, which means it's not getting used. And the rest of that is the accuracy. So you're 100% correct. 